Jobless restaurant workers are rallying around the country today in protest of the elimination of that extra $600 unemployment benefit. Brian New has been following the issue and joins us from downtown Dallas. So starting this week, those on unemployment will notice a much smaller check as that added $600 benefit is now gone. And many unemployed restaurant workers told us today that they believe that will result in more evictions, more poverty, and a downturn in economic spending. This afternoon, a group of unemployed restaurant workers held a rally in front of Senator Ted Cruz's office in Dallas. Democrats are pushing for an extension of the $600 benefit through the end of the year. And while most Republicans are on board with extending the payment, Republicans are proposing reducing the amount from $600 a week to $200 a week. Republicans contend $600 is too much and has kept people from returning to work. It's just absolutely not true. It, first of all, there's been studies that come out that said it's actually not de incentivizing people. But my response is that people should have uh, the choice to go back to work, especially during a pandemic. I mean, like, it's still unsafe to be out there. So Ivy Van says with that extra $600 benefit, she was actually making a little more on unemployment than she was when she was working at a restaurant, but says that is not what's keeping her from returning to work. This week, with no additional benefit, the average American worker on unemployment is receiving $300. In Dallas, Brian New, CBS 11 News. Well, one of the